Hey guys, today I want to take a couple of minutes to answer your questions. So if you follow me on Instagram like you should, then you'll know that a couple of days ago I reached out and asked you to submit some questions. So let's get to those questions right now. What will you do in Liberia? So the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to meet Joel because that's what you guys wanted. You wanted me to fly out there and meet him and introduce you to him. Uh, but then I want to look for opportunities to do some good. So we want to invest in schools and businesses and I just want to see firsthand what I think could use the most help. What is the first thing you'll say to Joel? Um, I don't know. It'll probably be really awkward. I, I envision it being like that scene in Star Wars where Han Solo meets Lando. You got a lot of guts coming here after what you pulled. But then we'll end up having a really happy reunion. <laughs> How you doing, you old pirate? So good to see you! How long will you stay in Liberia? I'm only going to stay there for a couple of nights. I want to get in and I want to get out before I get too sick. How much money have you raised for Liberia so far? Um, I don't know. I haven't really counted it uh, yet. We, we had a couple thousand dollars that we used for Christmas and for backpacks and for um, for that school that we donated to. Um, we still got a couple thousand more. Um, so yeah, that's why I want to go to Liberia. I want to figure out the best way to use that money. Are you scared to go to Liberia? Um, you know, right now I'm feeling pretty good, but I think that like the night before, I'm probably going to be curled up in a ball and crying and too scared to go, but um, right now I'm feeling pretty good. Will you stay with Joel in Liberia? Um, I will not be staying with Joel. Um, I don't know if he has a guest room or not, but I think that I'm going to feel the most safe staying in a hotel with running water and uh, hopefully security. What's your favorite music? Um, I don't know. I, I'm, I like all kinds of music. I'm kind of a Pandora type of guy, but uh, hands down, my favorite song is this. Liberia. What is your first name, dude? We know so much about you. Um, okay, so I wasn't going to tell you my first name, but I figure it's only a matter of time before you figure it out. Uh, so my first name is Ben. What countries do you have to go through to get to Liberia? Uh, good question. So I'm going to go to Chicago, then I'm going to go to Brussels, then I'm going to go to Sierra Leone, and then finally Liberia. It's going to be like two days of travel. It's going to be a nightmare. What is your life like outside of this series? Um, nothing too exciting. I mean, I have a job, I have a family, and uh, you know, that's why I don't get to put out these videos like every day like I wish I could. Because um, I gotta pay the bills, I gotta put food on the table. But uh, yeah, nothing too sexy or exciting. What state are you from? Do you have any pets? So if you ordered a book, then you would see on the return uh, address what state I'm from. So I'm not gonna tell you, I'm gonna make you order a book. And that's how you'll find out. Uh, I don't have any pets. Can I get a shout out in one of your videos? Uh, sure, you bet. Moose face, Mick. Moose face. What is the long-term plan for Joel in the series? Will you continue to support Liberia or focus on a new person in the future? Um, I don't know what the long-term plan is for the series. I just make these videos as the story unravels. I don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. I don't know what's going to happen next week. Um, but with your help, we will continue to make these videos and support Liberia and uh, wherever else. This isn't a question, but I just want to let you know how much I love the series. I may be a communist, but it warms my heart. <clears throat> well, thank you so much for the compliment. That means a lot. Um, we will convert you over to capitalism eventually. Are you my dad? I think so. Um, I don't think so. Does Joel know you're coming? Yes, Joel does know that I'm coming and he's very excited. Why are you so good at YouTube? Uh, thank you for the compliment. I didn't think I was that good. I mean, I don't have like Logan Paul subscribers or anything, but, uh, but I'll certainly keep trying my best, but I appreciate the compliment. What projects will you do in Liberia? Uh, so like I said, I want to invest in businesses and schools. I want to look for opportunities to do the most good. I think that if we can get those people to start producing on their own and be self-reliant, then they won't be dependent on donors and uh, nonprofits and all that kind of stuff. So schools and businesses. Will you eventually start a new series similar to Joel's? I think the concept is unique and really cool. Uh, well, thank you very much. Um, like I said, I don't know. We'll see what happens uh, tomorrow and next week and next month. I hope so. Have you considered your personal safety and security in Liberia? Not everyone's intentions will be good. Yes, I'm aware of that. That's why I've been looking into security, into safe places to stay, into drivers and all that kind of stuff. So uh, thanks for the concern. I will definitely keep it in mind. Do you think By the Grace of God could become a full on movie? Um, that'd be cool. Do you know any producers or directors? If you do, have them give me a shout. What got you started on YouTube? Uh, that's a good question. I should probably make a video, a separate video, to explain why I got into YouTube, a little bit more about me. I think, that, I think that'd be fun. So stay tuned. I'll try to release a, a second video about all that. 
What do you plan to accomplish in Liberia long-term goals? What are your views on the new president and vice president? Do you believe the economic situation will improve? Uh, well, I know that the um, new president coming in, that was like, the, first, that was like the, the most peaceful transfer of power in like 80 years. So I think that's a really good sign. Um, I, I think people want to see uh, the, the economy improve. I think that with your help, we can definitely help the economy. What additional support do you need and are you willing to partner with other projects currently in Liberia? Sure, I, you bet. Reach out to me. I'd love to partner with you. What do you say to all the people that called you a scammer at the start? Uh, to them I would say... If you had to say something to the whole world about helping people not only of Liberia but other countries that are stricken with poverty, what would it be? Um, I don't know. It would just be open your heart, open your wallet a little bit, get to know people a little bit, give them the benefit of the doubt. Um, you know, we're all here to help each other, so look for those opportunities. What does your family think of all this? Like, do they think it's very great, or are they confused a bit? Um, like, at first, I thought they, I think they thought I was crazy, but then they started thinking, oh, this is really cool. But now they're like, you're going to Liberia, you're crazy. So, a little bit of both. Are you in marketing or fundraising? Love your fundraising campaign. I use By the Grace of God mug every day. Yes, I do work in marketing. Thanks for buying the mug. Appreciate the support. What do you have in mind to do in Liberia? I think it's important to explain your plans in detail. I think I have been trying to explain my plans in detail. I'm going to go over there. I'm going to look for opportunities, business, education. I'll let you know. Tip, remember to drink clean food, water, only bottled water, no street food, preferably eat non-perishable food. In Liberia, we're talking about a hygiene that our bodies wouldn't tolerate. Thank you for the advice. I've definitely been looking into it, been talking to a lot of nurses. Uh, I'll be taking some medicine with me. Thanks for the tips. I'll take it with me. What is your favorite movie? Um, a lot of good movies. It's hard to top The Godfather, though. Are you planning to visit Musa as well? Um, I'm still waiting for Musa to call me back. So if Musa wants to meet with me, uh, the ball's in his court. I'm open to it. I'm an international relations student studying in Switzerland, and I'm fascinated by your sust sustainability project. Can I come with to help? Um, get a hold of me. We'll talk. So when are you visiting Liberia? I am not going to tell you when I'm going to visit Liberia. You're not going to know until after I get back, but uh, I'll tell you it's coming up pretty quick. Can you send me a postcard from Liberia? Um, I don't know if they sell postcards in Liberia, but if they do, you bet. Why don't you answer any effing questions? Um, what are you talking about? I spent this whole video answering effing questions. Um, but thank you for the questions. Thanks to all of you for the questions. This has been really fun. I hope it's been helpful. Um, I'm looking forward to going to Liberia. And uh, I will update you along every step of the way. So uh, subscribe, follow, and uh, we'll see you next time.